Hello and welcome back to another one of video. In this video, it's a bit of a special one because right here, I've got myself the AW 510H 7.1 surround sound headset from Alienware. Now, this headset, it's not very new, but as the years have gone on, it's gotten a bit cheaper. So, I've actually managed to pick this up for 80 Australian dollars. That is incredibly cheap for, I think, is an amazing headset. And especially the design and the packaging. That's a really nice packaging. Now, this, if you're going to get a brand new, at some stores, it's going to actually cost like $200. But if you find like smaller stores, you can actually just pick it up for uh, 160 to 100 But I got lucky, man, my friends. My friend's dad he had a few codes, and he let me use them. So, let's just quit babbling and get to the unboxing, to a new angle. So here, as you can probably see, we've got the box, and then you've got the headset outlined here. If you take a quick gander over here, you can see it says Discord Certified, which is great because I use that a lot, and 7.1 Surround Sound, which is fantastic. Now, I'm just going to quickly grab my scissors and start to open it. Now, you could just use your fingers. Or maybe you could just use, you know, a, you know, a knife or a box cutter, but it doesn't really matter. There we go. Sorry if you can see the stand there. I don't really have the most optimal setup for this, but there you go. We've got that plastic off. Now, time to extract. Oh. No. <laughs> Not time to extract, because here we've got a bit of plastic, as you can see. You grab it from here. Peel it off. And now it is time to extract the Alienware 510H. Now, I'm sorry if these angles aren't very optimal, noises conditions. Uh, I don't really have a good recording setup for unboxing like this, but I feel like this would work pretty well. Okay, there you go. Da -da 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 -da. Wow, that is that looks so nice. Now I went for the white version. You can get Midnight, Midnight Black for the same price, but I went for this one mainly because I think it looks cooler. Now, okay, standing this up, you gotta first remove it from the packaging. Okay, I don't know how to do this. Okay, here is the accessories. This is for, I'm pretty sure if you wanna use this on your phone, you can use this. Put that over there. And then this is an adapter for if you wanna use microphone and headset for your, uh, for your PC. And then this is USB, if you wanna also use this for your PC. You got volume up and down. I don't think that's a mute button, but it looks pretty cool. And then you got this. This is very yummy. I lied. Do not eat it, please. Alright, now we've just got the headset back in here. And it's got a few straps on it, so I'm just gonna quickly lift it up. Very elegantly, as you can see. Now it's, it's taped to the bottom pretty well, so you want to just be careful while doing this. As you can see, there's also some adhesive tape there. Just flip that off. Now we're gonna move this out uh, of the picture and move on to the headset. So it's got these velcro straps, which is really high quality and nice. So if it, you're getting Alienware, you know what you're getting into. You're getting high quality. Alienware, I like to call it the Louis Vuitton of gaming peripherals. You know, you got some basic ones like Razer or Corsair, but Alienware, you know you're gonna get some good quality stuff when you get it. And oh my God, picking it up, it feels so comfortable. I mean, look how smooth that is, and then here you've got the rubber. Now this probably will collect uh, grease and fingerprints, so you want to be careful with that. And then here you've got some RGB, got the pull-out microphone, very nice. It automatically goes up here to be close to your mouth, and you can move it away, towards, or you can just move it back in. Although it is, it is a bit of a struggle to move it back in, but that's fine. Now as you can see, you've got a bit of freedom here. So if you want to just put it on your neck and blast out music to be annoying, you can do that. And here you've got the uh, the microphone 3.5mm headphone jack spot. And I actually think that's it for the headset. Uh, yeah, that's basically it for the headset. Now if you look in here, the ear cups, you've got L and R. Very nice. Very, very appealing. Now let's head back to the ground level to feel the comfort of this beauty. Hello Space Ranger and welcome back to ground level. Now, before we head into the microphone test, I'm just going to show you uh, like what it looks like if you were to wear it. So I'm going to, I'm going to take off the hood. Don't really look. Don't look at me. Now I'm going to put like no, no that's, that's not matter. Now I'm going to put on the headset. So you got L, 
arm right there. Just gonna put it on like that. And the first thing I noticed when putting these on, this is very comfortable. You can easily play a couple hours of gaming or just have a really long talk sesh with your friends on Discord while wearing these because like right out the bat there is super comfortable. This mic isn't that close, although it does excuse me. It doesn't come with a muff, but that's alright. And yeah, all around, it feels comfortable. I can't tell if it looks weird, it probably does. Uh, but yeah, that's the comfort. Let's move on to the mic test. Hello and welcome to the mic test. Now, the audio that you're hearing right now is coming through this little doohiggy. Um, so, I feel like it's okay, and I don't think the mic pops. So, if you're listening to me say P-words, like playground, pool, it won't pop the mic. Time for the outro. Thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed. If you found this informative, and if, say, you're going to buy a headset after this, make sure to subscribe. And, yeah.